Namaste. Wishing you a great time ahead. I would like to discuss on the 14th video from Circle today. We have been knowing about different theoretical proofs since few days. Continuing the same lesson, we will be learning about concyclic points and tangents in today's class. Please do subscribe the channel, share the videos and click on the notification icon for the regular updates. In the given figure, Tn is the tangent of the circle given which is parallel to the line segment AB and we are expected to prove A, B, C and D are concyclic points of a circle. Let's start our today's session with the definition of tangent and concyclic points. Tangent is that straight line which touches the circle at only one point from outside. In the first figure, PT is a tangent and in the second figure, both line segments AC and BC are tangents. Now, a set of points are said to be concyclic if all of them lie on a common circle. In other words, all concyclic points must be in equal distance from the center. In the given figures, two points can be concyclic if the given chord is a diameter. Three points or four points can be concyclic if all of them lie on the circumference of the circle as shown on the screen. Now, continuing the proof, we first draw the figure, mention the provided informations and now drawing the statement region table and studying the figure, we can write angle TSA is equal to angle SDC as angle TSA is made by the chord SC and angle SDC is made by the arc SC. We call this type of angles as the angles made by alternate segments which are always equal. Also angle TSA is equal to angle BAS as they are alternate angles made by parallel line segments AB and TN. Now comparing statements 1 and 2 we can write angle BAS is equal to angle SDC as shown on the screen. Therefore ABCD now becomes cyclic quadrilateral angle BAS being exterior angle of a cyclic quadrilateral ABCD and angle SDC being opposite interior angle with equal angular value. This is one of the major property of a cyclic quadrilateral. Hence, we can conclude that points A, B, C and D are concyclic points as four concyclic points in a circle always form a cyclic quadrilateral from statement 4. Hoping that it was a clear explanation for you. With a wish of your prosperous life, see you in the next similar video. Take care. Bye-bye.